He's still showing up to Smash tournaments because, you know, they pay pretty decent when you're really good at the game. Right, as a Tata is. So he will be teaming up with the Kirby Extraordinaire, and Tata told me a thing or two about their shenanigans that Ness Kirby are going to mm. do. Which mostly, in, well, the one he described to me is mostly involving Kirby eating Ness mm. and then PK flashing Ness to heal him. Yeah. Which Fun sounds stuff. awful. Uh, it sounds like Kirby. It, sound, it sounds like, it Kirby, sounds like doubles. Kirby doubles. It sounds like Ness doubles. Yeah. yeah. The old Anubis strat way back from the, the Smash Bros. Brawl <laughs> days was the, that was the Lucas Lucario. Mm. Cheese, if you're oh, ever familiar man. with that. Yeah, I remember what, seeing some Aura of that. acts. Just, I, I think in Brawl, Aura might have acted differently in doubles than it does now. Uh, I think, I honestly think that Aura has acted differently in, in the last three games that Lucario's been in. Yeah. I think, well, they might have scaled it and then they might have, like, made it and then scaled it up and then they had to, like, scale it back because it was too strong in Smash 4. Yeah, in Smash 4, it was. Definitely a little bit out of pocket. <laughs> yeah. In this game, it's more reasonable, and that's why you never see people play Lucario. Right. You right. don't really play that character unless you're like specifically going for the cheese. That's another character who just changes the rules of the game. Lucario, we're, yeah. We're, we're just coming up with the list as we go. Yeah, so I th the list is up to like Steve, Kazuya, uh, Lucario, We Fit. I said Game & Watch. I didn't even say Sonic before. Oh. And that's like a clear omission. I, I'm not so sure about Sonic. Uh there is a discussion to be had for Sonic changing the rules of the game. Hero. Hero does change the rules of the game. Uh, I think Joker, to an extent, changes the rules of the game. Yeah. Characters that have... I could hear... I'll hear the argument for it. I'll hear the argument for it. Characters that have meter, like some sort of meter or like a comeback mechanic, quote-unquote, change the rules of the game a bit. Right, but the more meter characters they add comeback mechanics like that, that just becomes the rules of the game, right? Yeah, that's fair. So you're power creeping like the original cast, but that's right. that's a whole game design discussion we can have another <laughs> day because now we have filled enough time. We are in doubles. There's a K rule and a Wii Fit on one side and a Ness and a Kirby on the other. This is just feeding time for Ness. Yeah, he just gets the stage and then Kirby just floats over here like hit them generally by me and then we'll be in business. All right, after the scramble, it looks like they kind of set back up into position. But again, Kirby's just got to be in that one spot. Alpha dash attack, he gets the back air. On that platform. That platform seems like a great spot to be in. Oh. Yeah, but when you're playing against a heavy character like K. Rule, someone who hits as hard as they do, it makes it so much more difficult. But they're getting comboed, so it doesn't even... Okay, I like the awareness there from So Good Pop to save his teammate with the up smash. <laughs> oh, the Croc's in town. That's huge. Oh. Oh. Ooh. But the punish on the back end. Okay, JJ, I like what you're throwing down. These guys are swinging. And Man. then he died. And, okay, even stocks, but not. Uh, oh my gosh, yeah, So Good Pop is the one that is ta stock tanking and uh, not the heavy character. That's Wii Fit's role in doubles is definitely to beat the stock tank. Anyone who has like a charge shot is just designated stock tank, right? And with the low profile that Wii Fit can bring to the board, it helps to stay alive even longer. But the problem is when you're on the stock tank role and you have a heavy on the other side, you can just duo the heavy. Uh, and now that Sogapop has lost that first stock, it does make things a little tougher, Ooh! but the side B spike sending nets. Straight down, evening up the stocks yet again. But Copal, a little bit worse for wear. Yeah, he's, Ooh, he's bleeding out there. Yep. And look how low JJ can go for these KOs. Finding that perfect angle under the helicopter that K Rule uses to recover. Uh, and just when you think JJ is going to use the up B, there's that back air. Super strong coming right at you, taking your stock. And a very quick game one in this winner's finals is looking very good for Atata and Jaja. I think they need to change the timer back. I think it's still at 10 minutes. Because it shouldn't be at 7.38 right now. It should be an eight minute timer. But oh, okay. um, we'll get it fixed for game two. It's all good, it's all good. Anyway, hey, hey. We Fit loses the stock first of the two. I thought for sure <laughs> it would be another team up on the K roll, but instead this is not the 1v2 you want if you're the red team. No, not at all.
Especially with Ness having two stocks in the tank. Man. Oh, yeah. Ness I mean, doesn't have to get near this croc. Not at all. It is a little better. Ooh, oh, okay. Okay. I see it. I see the vision. I see I was, it. I was thinking back air off the jump, but it was it was uh, down air instead. All right. Clean it up. No? Never. Okay. I thought that would KO. Over there. Oh. Let's just go to the next. Okay. Let's go to the next. Yeah. I, to be honest, if my life was on the line <laughs> and I had K, I, you, you gave me K rule versus those two characters in 1v2 and they said, to stay alive, win this, I would just not know what to do. It, it, it was, <laughs> if you I'll gave me infinite time to like lab a scenario in which I could come out of that 1v2 alive, I, I don't know. <laughs> I'll take whatever form of execution immediately. It's that's, crazy. That's so hard. <laughs> you have two characters that are low, to, that are small, low, and have crazy combo potential. And you're a large, heavy character that has no control of the neutral whatsoever, even <laughs> in singles. <laughs> yeah. And then a character that can inhale you and take your ability. At least we <laughs> Fit could like come up with something. Yeah. One of two, right. At least come up with some cheese factor. Come up with some spikes or, or some we uh, deep breathing shenanigans. Right. K rule is like nah. Oh boy. They are. They do not want to touch the ground. The floor is hot lava here. They don't want to go on the stage. They want. They want nothing to do with it. Okay. Got a full voice line. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> How did Ness get spiked? These ledges are so crowded. And now K. Rule has the stage control. Why not? Sure. K. Rule can just do that. Ooh, <laughs> ooh. Into the ground. However far down it may be. Yeah. Kirby's swimming in that waterfall in the back. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, how far down can you go? Oh, he had the crown. Yeah, with, with the crown in hand, you can just set up whatever you like. But what a perfect angle on the recovery there for Copeland. Pretty incredible he's able to make it back to the stage. And now he's going to hold serve in the center here. Kirby trying to push the issue, but there's too many projectiles just laying around. There's crowns, there's cannonballs. <laughs> there's just so many. Th oh, okay. Almost had the crown catch on the back here. Trying to push that crown advantage. JJ is. Oh, oh. who got popped? Ooh, ooh. And what a quick turn around with the hammer. I like the killer instinct from JJ. Sometimes it can be really hard to like get that confirmed kill off of the, the shield grab, or the shield pub, but he gets it. And before we even know it, Red Team has a bit of a lead here, and with a Tata at 106%. Oh, but no. Oh, no. There's really scary. So but good pop down around. a stock. Shared it? Yeah, you got to. Oh, huge save. JJ was a about to get hit. Oh. I like the trickiness with the inhale trick there. Trying to turn it around into a combo with your teammate, but good awareness there from Kobo to know that nothing's confirmed off of that. Okay, JJ is oh no. Good trade for red team. Very. And yeah, three stocks for Kirby. You did not want to have Ness hanging around at a really high percent because then, like, heal factor could come back into play if you do get it to turn around into 1%. That's two. true. So sealing the deal on Atata here is a big deal for the red team. I didn't even think of that, honestly. I Like, it might not have been on JJ's mind either. Like, given the scramble situation, that, that is really tough to set up at that time of Oh, it wasn't going to be possible to set up until the 1 versus 2, but, like, the longer you let them hang around is what I'm saying. That's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's yeah, the yeah. big problem. So now it's Kirby against the world. And you can do some shenanigans with Kirby in 1v2. Like, look how low he's going to go here off the side of the stage. And he can even fend away the, the Wii Fit trainer. Yeah, they're... Uh, yeah, saving on the bat. All right, all right. Huge! <laughs> off the yeah. parry, very clean from So Good Pop. Look at that smile, look at that! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, you just know you feel you you feel so good after something like that. You hit that double parry into the F tilt, and you're like, "Yeah, I'm that guy. I'm that guy. <laughs> I'm so good at this game." <laughs> they were the protagonists in game two for sure. You saw how many spikes they were gonna line up on the linear recoveries. It was especially clean early stuff. Yeah, Damn. that set the tone for the entire match. Oh, absolutely. These guys have the ability to clean up off stage. We fit and K rule that down. That K rule down air. 
is... I think it's actually the strongest spike in the game. E I think it's tied with Ganondorf? Maybe. I don't know. I, regardless of if it is it's, it's or not, it is stupid strong. Yeah. Especially when you're dealing with a character like Ness or even Kirby. Kirby less so because of the amount of jumps, but Ness, you get hit with one down air and it's kind of wraps for your, for your stock. Well, like those... those K. Rule, Ganon, Falcon type spikes. Remember when a, a, a spike sends you into like the magnifying glass, like, it hits the, the lower blast zone mm -hmm. super early. So like, even when you have a bunch of jumps, if you're at like 30%, you're in danger of just like crossing the lower blast zone. Yeah, like you don't get the opportunity to mix up your recovery anymore. It's straight to the ledge or you're done. Yeah. So the biggest stage in the format we go, town and city. Makes sense here. I think a lot for... It, it was actually Green Team's counterfeit, but I kind of like it for red. Just create a little bit more space. It does seem to be working well for green, though. In, in these early scraps? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, Let's spread things out a little bit. Oh, and setting up, up the yo-yo on the left side. JJ trying to get the edge guard on the right. Green Team in control at the start of this one. Yeah, and that's kind of why I like this for green. I mean, yeah, it does give the red team a lot of space to throw their projectiles and do what they do what they want to, but it also gives the red team the ability to split up the red. The green team split up the red team and then scrap as they yeah. do. I really liked how JJ sealed off that stock. It looked like they were playing those 1v1 games split across the sides. Then he turned around and just flipped the script over onto uh, So Good Pot to take the stocks. Uh, you, you thought it's a 1v1 and then you're getting 2v1 while you're trying to get back on stage. And K. Rool's not fast enough to get over there. Yeah. Oh, okay. Good read there. Ooh. Okay. And we're, we're swinging right back. First stock taken for the red team. Oh, man. Situational awareness is so much more important in doubles, and it's part of the reason why I love this format so much. Mm -hmm. Like, you have to be aware. Like, normal setups aren't normal setups in doubles. You have to, you have right. to know, like, what your, other, what your opponent's doing, and, like, maybe a different move is better suited for a different situation. And normal punishes are not just, like, the things you can always do, right? You have to play around your opponent doing something different, which is how Atata took that stock there. He went for the back air on the Sokut shield. It crossed over and actually hit Kopo, sent him flying. Oh, my gosh. Stocks flying left and right. Four to three in favor of green team. Now uh. knocking the K-roll off to the left and just going to try to keep him pinned there. <laughs> but so good knows that you guys are searching for that platform. Gets poking up there with the forward air. Oh, my gosh. So good getting bounced around, kind of like his volleyball, into a 75, 97, <laughs> Nair 108. Oh, my gosh. What a this crazy combo. Oh, my gosh. Okay. What a tech from JJ on that down air. Yikes. And cleaning up the Wii Fit Trainer, forcing the share stock. Now Copal is bleeding out to dry, mm. and he will die to the back air. All of a sudden, it's this one versus two. But it is the one that you actually more <laughs> would prefer, but it might not even matter. <laughs> you, you're at 70%. You blinked. Oh, oh man. he's not making it. Oh, no, he saved the jump. He saved the jump. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. You saved the jump that whole time, only the neutral get up. You remember that episode of Drake and Josh where they have the ping pong table in their room and they just, like, go back and forth for, like, a full minute? That's ex <laughs> that's what I was picturing. Just Kirby and Ness taking turns. It's like, yeah, hit, 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 hit. These guys are scrapping, just tossing. We fit back and forth. It they is. had that rebound game so locked up. Oh, my gosh, yeah. And it wasn't even, like, the same move back and forth. It was, like, it was like Kirby Nair, Ness back air into Kirby back air into Ness and air. I'm like, gosh. You have to be just so on point and know where to go at what time. It's, ugh. it's harder in ultimate doubles compared to like the Smash 4 doubles meta that we were so familiar with for so long because, you know, the balloon knockback makes it hard to time. Mm -hmm. But these players at these top level of doubles show that you can time it. It's mm -hmm. very easy to, well, maybe not easy, but it is very practicable to get the timing of these balloon knockback hits and just get big damage oh my gosh yeah honestly i gotta feel a little bad for so good pop in that game like he was just getting massacred at, at different points in the game he was just taking 70 percent of damage in just uh like a single go looks and like so good swapping his controller out i think he's had a couple of controller issues today i saw that in cruise yeah in cruise versus michigan state a team it sounded like his controller maybe I don't know what what died on it. He stuck with the game. Yeah. But I guess you kinda have to. Yeah. So going for the backup strat here. 
Does he usually play on Procon? You know, I don't know the answer to that. But he is on a GameCube now. Okay. Shout out uh, his teammate. I think that was Oniranaut. Not entirely sure. But yeah, shout out Captain whoever. Captain of the... Uh, the <laughs> Yeah, so shout out whoever gave us so good a second chance at life. We'll see if it's enough to turn around this set to a game five, or if it will be a Ted and JJ moving on to Grand's 3-1, where mean, they will be waiting a hot minute yeah. for Grand Finals, because Loser's is a little bit behind. Yeah, just a little. But that's, uh, that's how Ultimate Double works. It can go incredibly fast or just, you know, a little slower pace. Whatever suits your fancy. But for me... I like fun, and this has been nothing but that. We are we are going to pick the smallest stage possible <laughs> for this next doubles match. I do. I think So Good and Copo like the smaller stages. Oh my! <laughs> How much damage can that K roll armor take? I think it's like. Oh 30 no! It's Hada off the bounce. He can get the rebound, wow. but oh, the strange lip of. Uh, Hollow Bastion might have messed with it there. Okay. If anyone can get those those killer recoveries <laughs> with Ness, it's Tata. Like, that one must have just been impossible. If he missed yeah, it. that was a... Would have been amazing, but unfortunate. Now we'll put the green team on the back foot here as things start to work their way into it. But good spike here on the uh, recovery. JJ, JJ sniping a K rule on the right side. Yeah, and very good timing on that K rule recovery that... That Helicroctor is a little tough to time. Using Final Cutter to just apply additional pressure on the top of the stage. I, I love the Final Cutter usage we've seen from this. I feel like Final Cutter usage in general has just grown exponentially in mm. this game. Like, I saw it not at all. We didn't see Kirby much at all in 4, but yeah. in this game, it has just been so much more. And the backer from center stage is going to seal up So Good Pop's stock. That puts them on even two stocks apiece. And one member of each team bleeding out a little bit more than the others. Yeah, you're done. Oh, but So Good didn't have the jump after that final cut. No. Yeah, went off stage to try and save Copal, but ended up losing the stock. In. Ooh, dash tag okay. takes that tad out. And up spike right back. All of a sudden, uh, it looked like uh, Red wait, Team was oh, out what? of it, and now it's tied. Yeah, where did everyone, where did everyone's stocks go? It was a so good spike. That took out Kirby on like 40. <laughs> like I said, no matter how many jumps you can get back, if yeah. you can uh, hit them in the magnifying glass below the stage. Speaking of strong spikes, ooh. oh, now you got deep breathing on lock. This is a lot closer than I thought it was. Ooh, okay. Big combo. That almost killed Kirby. You had 70% after the hit. Oh. Everyone's living. Nah, this is just getting closer and closer. If Deep Breathing comes back online, this is just very, very scary. Watching yeah. out for Ness. So good wants one thing. It's that sliding forward tilt. But in so avoiding so good pop, here comes Copa with the back throw. Gonna set up the one versus two again. Ooh, JJ taking care of both teammates, splitting them up. Ooh. How long can you get still here? I think that was the last jump. Okay, we are able to reset to the ledge. Don't, I don't, uh, Carol was so large, there was no uh, opportunity for So Good to come in and punish. There, yeah. All right, okay. all right, all right. That's a tough situation to be in. I mean, now let's try it I guess the controller worked. <laughs> the con yeah, the controller, that controller worked. Definitely seemed to work. These are incredibly fast-paced games. Yeah. They, they are holding forward, <laughs> hitting the buttons. Going to the smallest stage possible it to seems, hit the buttons faster. It seems to be working for Copal and So Good. I, I can, and I could definitely see why. I mean, you have K. Rool and and Wee Fit who are very strong characters and have a lot of kill potential. Keeping them in a more condensed space, these smaller characters with smaller hurt boxes, is just inherently advantageous yeah. for the larger, stronger characters. Well, we're gonna go to another slightly larger stage, like you mentioned. I think Green Team likes to have a little bit more space to work with, uh, a little more space to bait out those movements from K. Rule that are so punishable when you do so. 
cool. Yeah, and but now the turnaround to save your teammate here. I like Ness going in, getting the hits in on Wii Fit when you have the opportunity, and Wii Fit's on the stage. Oh, but the Great. turnaround on the back air with the deep breathing Ooh. explodes, Kirby. What a reversal. I cannot believe Kirby died there. I Kirby was either. so low. It looked like Sogood was just going to get comboed into the bottom blast zone, but eh, side blast zone off that back air anyway. And now how deep is JJ going to go for this K rule? Pretty deep, but not deep enough. Good recovery there, especially with Sogood getting into the face of that Kirby just to be a little bit more disruptive. Absolutely. Oh, man. Ooh. All right. In the scrap, you get a Ness with another back air. Now, K rule is the stock tank, which is not words you expect to say really often, if at all. But okay, one grab, yo yo. That's going to even up these stocks. Uh, very simple stuff, especially when K rule is at that high of a percent. Uh oh. Okay, so good. Yeah, using the volleyball to get through that down here. Yeah, that volleyball is messing with knockback in such strange ways. It's wow! Working out, but oh! Wait, who died? Oh, oh, Red team died Red team. again? Yeah, uh, so good used the soccer ball uh, to try and hit Ness further off stage. Succeeded, but also put himself out of position and got back aired by Kirby. What a crazy scramble. And again, the, this green team is not afraid to go fly off the stage and fight with these guys. It's fun to see. God, this has been... Uh-oh, so good in a very bad spot. I was super worried for a tatter there, but I really shouldn't have been. I mean, the, the, the dude is good at his job recovering <laughs> with this terrible recovery on Ness. Quote, terrible recovery. Quote, yes. We could talk about that later. <laughs> and he Atata, makes a living out of it. Oh, sure. yeah, for sure. Atata still holding on to that stock. Not anymore. F-Tilt going to steal that away. One stock apiece. This is where the bread gets made. Game five, one stock down for everyone. They want to keep this K roll at the ledge as long as possible. They don't really care if uh, there are projectiles coming from the Wii Fit on the other side. They see this as the opportunity to strike, but oh, K-Roll does sneak back on as soon as they turn around. Oh, did that hit the belly? My okay, the trip wow. will finish the job there. Gus missed timing the armor, but again, like you said, did not matter. And now we fit has to get back to the stage and PK Just Thunder well. from the sky. Thunder comes and <laughs> to the sky we fit goes. Into made, grand finals. Made, made a valiant attempt to get that deep breathing going, but that is exactly what Atata wanted. Wanted to take away that option as long as possible.